Dave Cha-Ching, Mr. Gimme Three, man. I'm here, man. Ross Sloan, the voice, Zone Six, the voice of Brooklyn, the voice of the city, in my opinion, right now. Basketball wins when we get moments like that. Yeah, 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 we back. Good Brothers Podcast. Me and my brother Cha-Ching. Got my brother G Irv with us today. We hey. deliver today. We 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 do we said we was gonna deliver. We said we was gonna make a couple calls. We made a call live to make this call, make this um this park happen. MG, what's up? How's everything? What's up, what's up? Appreciate y'all brothers for having me, man. Less than twenty four hours. Less than twenty four hours, we made the call. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We, 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 put the, we put the um, put that we put the panic too. call in. Less than twenty four. A lot, a lot been transpiring for you this roughly about three, four weeks. How, how you feeling, Nas? Hey, coach. I mean, I mean, y'all pretty much know G. We not really gonna go too much into the to his good old glory days, but we we gonna transition a lot into his coaching. I mean, summer ball and stuff like that. But, you know, a lot transpired last three weeks. How you feeling? Nas, how you feeling? Double A? Great, man. It's, it's, it's something that, you know, I, I visioned when I started at Nas. And now, you know, the hard work is paying off. I think uh, the city is seeing what, you know, me and our coaching staff is doing. You know, I know a lot of people like to give me the credit, but it's all of us. But... It's the big leagues. I mean, so they say. You know what I mean? And um, now it's time to, you know, work. I mean, well, I, I watch you. I watch you all last season. I probably went to probably one of the hard, hardest games I could actually watch as a friend last year. Um, this past March in, in Fordham. I I know you can transition to that level how 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 you think the transition is going to be though the first year you know the first year is probably one of the hardest years but knowing you knowing your style knowing where you come from your upbringing like how you think it's going to be i mean if they say it's the big leagues but it's really much you scrimmage everybody all season anyway so honestly i think um you know i put in the work night in and night out you know, I'm always up watching film. I'm watching to see what other schools is doing. Uh, as honestly as I can say, I think we're going to be really good. You know, um, if one thing we're going to do, we're going to play the right way. We're going to play hard. Um, I think that my coaching style is, you know, fits this league. I think that the confidence in the players fit this league. And, you know, this is something that the young men been waiting for. You know, a lot of them could have went double A, you know, and they trust my process, you know, uh, for me at NAS, you know, being an A school, you know, really getting a chance to play some double A schools, whether it's, you know, in preseason or in scrimmages, you know, I think we handled ourselves well, you know, obviously there's a difference between scrimmages, I mean, they say, but, you know, I think that um, everything is in motion. Um, I'm going to get the players that are, you know, that's that's needed. Before before I pass it over to Rod, because Rod, this is you know Rod, like this is like a kind of like a Brooklyn thing. So I'm a, I'm gonna step back, nah, right? We both Have the fo- has the phone calls started coming in for particular talent? Like has them calls started coming in yet? Yo, G, what's up? I'm trying to what's up? What's up? What's up? Because remember, you know when you a, a lot of people interested, but they interested they you know they really want the double A bump. So now have you been getting those? 
those calls, like kids, parents, uh, faculty, I mean, friends, I got this kid, this kid, because it is the big leagues, even though you got what we saw at, in March, you got some studs to hang, but you know you still got to upgrade somewhere. Yesterday's price ain't today's price. Oh, Jesus Christ. As simple as that. You know Just what leave I mean? that. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but you know what I mean? I think that the biggest thing about it, like I said before, the people see what we're building. And before AA, yeah, yeah. it was conversations. You know what I mean? But now, obviously, you know, it's, it's, it's a different ball game. So we're going to see. We're going to see. I wanted, see. I wanted to ask you from playing to now coaching and really being one of the top coaches in the city with a lot of respect, what's the difference from coaching and playing? From being out there and coaching it on court and then really coaching from the sideline? The difference, I mean, is really, besides really I can't be out there, you yeah. know what I mean, to help me, I think the difference is um, the patience. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I mean, I play with patience, but it's a different type of patience because I'm an athlete, you know, I did it at a high level. I'm aggressive when it comes to this basketball stuff. So I have to understand that my, my team, my kids, they not me. You know what I mean? I think that some people, when they watch the game of basketball, they kind of vision themselves playing. And it's always brought back to this is not back in the day. You know what I mean? They're not tough enough. You know, all the other stuff. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? But they don't see the ins and outs, you know, the day-to-day -day practices, the day-to-day -day hard work, you know, that makes it. So I think that that's the difference. So when I'm watching it, actually – kind of as assistant coach more than a head coach. You know, once I became a head coach, it's like, all right, well, you know, you can't compare. You know, you just got to get them to that point. People say that you can't give people dog. You can. Mm -hmm. You really can. But, you know what I mean? So I think that that's the difference in, 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 in coaching and playing mm -hmm. for me. Like, G. Irv, like, like, you did it at so it's like the high level, like like we college, overseas. High school. Did you vision did you vision being a head coach or being just some type of coach? Not at all. Never. In a million years. I mean, we all think that, you know, it's always NBA. You know what I mean? That's mm -hmm. always the goal. And I mean, like, especially somebody that, you know, who was in arm's reach. You know what I mean? Like, I felt that it was NBA and nothing else. But my college coach told me I was going to make a, a a hell of a head coach. And I used to tell him he's bugging. Like, coach, you're bugging. I'm never coaching. I'm hooping for the rest of my life. You know what I mean? But realistically, that probably, you know, it was at the back of my mind. But Tiny Morton, he's the reason why I'm actually – like really, really coaching right now. So he, what well, he forced you, or well, he pulled you in the office, made a call to you, say he wants you on staff. Cause for you, like, you kind of came up quick. Fuck. Like Nas, system, then boom, 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 boom. Like hop, like no calls, nothing. Like just like yo, G, I need you. Simple, yo. You got a lot to offer to the kids. You still hooping. They respect you. Yo, come coaching me at Juice. You know what I mean? I think you will like it. He said, yeah, I brought Ty Goody with me, formed that. And after that, you know, really, really enjoyed it. I mean, obviously, it's because I had some young hitters that New York didn't know about. You know what I mean? So that was really big. You know, I had, you know, Kadari, Terry Roberts, Manzi. You know what I mean? The list goes on. But we had a little crew with 16U, and then the enjoyment came. The kids started gravitating towards me. And after that, it was like, yeah, you can go overseas and make some money. You could play, you know, with your back injured, you know, or you, you could change, nowhere. transition, so and help the youth. You know what I mean? So maybe that was really God's plan. The NBA was arm's reach, but obviously this coaching stuff is, I love it just as much now. Not to change. Let's switch the topic a little bit now. Yeah. Appreciation of everything else. 
Exactly. We can, we can, can. One more year. Basketball? In the streets. Facts. My kids asked me this I heard today. Two, I heard it's two more. Huh? My kids asked me today, like, yo, you going to say you playing if they ask you? Facts. <laughs> yes. Let me let me I'm gonna give it back to Ron, right? You, you know, you know, early in our episodes we had like the farewell tour. When can we actually say, yo, Jerv, we gotta put you on a farewell tour? When I'm handicapped. Like you don't never let the ball start bouncing. You know what I mean? I kept saying it, I kept thinking about it. Like, yo, like I'm done, let's chill. And everybody like, yo, bro, you got the ability to do it. Why not do it? A lot of people still can't, you know, play, and they want to play. So I'm actually doing it for really the OGs. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like yeah, the people you're that pretty much the last one that, standing, really. Like yeah. that, that, that couldn't do it. Even the ones before me that was in the streets. You know what I mean? Like mm-hmm. I got my neighborhood big bro KB. Like he like, bro, you can't, you can't stop right now. We just had this talk the other day. So yeah, I mean. Like, as long as my body can go through it, I mean, which I put in, you know, the work, I make sure I take care of my body. So, as long as I can handle it, I'm going, I'm, I'm going to continue to play. Hey, bro. Dangerous. <laughs> play the dangerous game, right? <laughs> dangerous, man. LeBron James the street oh, ball. This yeah. is what I keep saying. Oh, oh, but. this jersey is for a reason, though. I don't think I just, I changed into this. Oh, God. oh that's the. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Yeah. That was to send a message. Hello. Hello. I, I think. Who's victims this year? Who, this, who you? Who you really like? I need to see son. A couple people was talking. I know how people get. They send. They send posts. They want to send. They comment under things. Who you feel like? Even though you probably feel like nobody's really a threat, it's just like nah. I just want to see him one more time. Just to let him know, like, stop playing with me, like. Franchise player talking to a mascot, bro. I ain't going for nobody. I'm too old for that. <laughs> they got to worry about the people in their age bracket before mm-hmm. hollering at me. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like, I, I'm always humble. You know what I mean? But let's call a spade a spade. Stop talking to me like <laughs> y'all did what I did. Like, I'm about to be 40. I averaged 26, 27 in Gersh. Got MVP in the championship on one leg. Like. I ain't got nothing to prove. Mm-hmm. It's just for me. It's for actually why I'm coaching. It's my players. They want to come see me play. They ask me every day in school, yo, Coach G, you playing? I'm wow. playing. So that's why I'm doing it. Like, playing against other people, like, that's that's crazy. That's what you do when you when you they young. They talking, OG. That's cool. That's cool. They that's talking, right. they I are know in the team. back of your mind, I know you. So I know down is like, when I see him, I, I'm going to violate like, for sure, but give credit though. You can't give credit to people that's, you know what I mean? Like it's people that if I see them on that schedule, I'm like, oh, all right, we play them. You know what I mean? You gotta, you gotta get ready. You got a tournament limit? One tournament, two tournament, three? I said, yeah, but I don't know. Oh, you don't know, just whatever, just the day, how you feeling? It's whatever. I'm gonna come outside with my tights on, the my shorts, yeah, yeah, yeah. even you if I'm chilling. You might walk around just in your tights, yeah, and so. some sneakers in. <laughs> And if it, if, it, if it get too crazy. I mean, I love it. So, you know what I mean? Like, it is what it is. I mean, I am definitely. I know when I feel like I'm tired and I really want to hang it up, that's when I'm probably going to try to, like, play in a, a few, few. To You know what I mean? Yeah, we know Gersh, obviously. You know what I mean? But I'm definitely sneaky playing in a few. You know, few sneaky playing a few? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm right. sneaky playing a few. So, uh, damn. That's really... From the from the past to now, what's the difference in the street ball too? Was it would you feel like it's more competition then, or it was more competition now? I think it's social media. I think that it wasn't that much social media back then. It's 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 a lot of hype because of the social media. You know what I mean? Like it's definitely is talent. Yeah. But you get a lot of people that. Talk the game. Nah, we can call the spade, G. We here, oh, we on yeah, the podcast. You know, it, be still... mad, it, be, it be mad niggas that's dirt. 
and they be online. Oh, I was like getting, I was, I was getting to that. Oh, I was going to talk about the oh, highlights. Yeah, could, could <laughs> I was going to talk about the highlights, and it looked like they had yeah, thirty. You know and they had like twenty seconds six. on the layup line. <laughs> yeah, I don't, yeah, but I don't think I think the difference is that we, I guess, back in the day, like it wasn't nobody buddy ball. You know what I mean? Like it yeah, wasn't man. yo. We all teaming up to play with this. We teaming up to play with that. Like I could have went somewhere else and played. With a different team at Gershon, won five, six championships. Mm -hmm. I do it for my hood. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not doing all that. Shout out if it, and if shout it, out SOG. If it comes to that, to where we just got a brick, cool. You know what I mean? But you look at it. We play, I play. We always in the final four. We always that's a fact. at the top. And that's with every year we got damn near a whole new roster. You see Kuda, Dane. Me, Big Vern, everybody else is new every year. Every year. Mike Woods, he left, came back. He was one of the, you know. Yeah. But other than that, we always come with a new squad, and some, somehow, some way, we find ourselves right there in the mix of it all to win a chip. Two, and two years back to back, we got injuries. We could have had those chips. So. Who the you know new pieces this Shout year? Shout out to ADC, though. You know what I mean? They beat us. Who the new pieces this year? Can we get one or two? Man. I know you're in the front office. Can we? I know that. <laughs> I, I know that. I know can, can we get one? I don't want the whole. Can I get one or two? The one that'd be like, oh, all right. It's real over there. Sheesh. I don't know. You know what I mean? I don't know. <laughs> Tell you the truth. I'm not even going to lie, bro. I'm not even going to lie. I mean, we may have something. You know what I mean? But. The thing is, until it's over, till they Can step I on the court. Can I get one, man? Can I get one? Yo, bro, you until they the step. Office, listen, <laughs> till they step on the court. Oh, matter of fact, I'm going to hold it down. Yeah, you right. Yeah. I know it's up. Till they step on the court, you know what I mean? I know it's up. Other than uh, that, but we do got, you know, we do got I know it's up. a few sneaky, like, pieces yeah. that, you know, that's really, really possible. Yeah. And it's, it is, could be game changers, but you know what I mean? We're going, you know, we're going to see. Off the air, off the air, off the air, off the air. We don't want nobody, you know, you know, it's a salty town. You know? Oh, yeah, they <laughs> definitely Ryan yeah, Apple yeah, is they crazy. Get, they get real salty out here. <laughs> I mean, we, we on the topic of summer basketball. You know, I got to always throw in, throw in the young hitters. New York versus New York. Mm. I'm starting to get tired of you in a good way. You starting to win. You, you're winning too much, but in a good way. You you coming back this summer? You, they read you up. You coming back this summer for New York versus New York? Or what you doing? The name of the game is the win. I mean, I, I I think you know. I think they. I ain't gonna say I think they should. We already know. Yeah, I'm back. I do got a new piece though. A new a new coach that <laughs> New York gonna love. I mean, maybe two. I'm the two, 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 two. <laughs> I mean, are you are you don't want to you don't want to leak nothing right now? I mean. They around, they around New Heights. Yeah, they, 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 they close. How close yeah. they are? I mean, I don't know. Maybe arms reach. Yeah, arms reach. You know what I mean? Feel me? Arms reach. But, arms reach. But you know what I mean? I ain't gonna, you know, really say. But yeah. Shout out to Gino Lawrence. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> shout out to Gino, Gino Lawrence. You know what I mean? Like yeah. shout out to him. You know what I mean? Like he's starting to give back. You know what I mean? He shout had out Eagle. my boy Gino. You know he coaching. You know, he's definitely, you know, he part of the staff. So that's, did, you know, that's big time. Did y'all ever have those conversations? Because I used to battle a lot. Gino, all y'all, like, did y'all ever, like, yo, we gonna go, like, y'all ain't thinking at all, like, yo, we could be coaches? Because Gino played high level basketball for crazy years. Like, y'all don't come across Whoa. those conversations, like, yo, bro, we really doing something different. We haven't even really sat down, you know what I mean? Like, it's always been, like, really congrats, you know what I mean? Dope that he's doing it, you know what I mean? Um, we do come about across those conversations when we was in the backcourt, though, when we used to kill everybody. Scary. 40 and 30. Yes. You know what I mean? We do talk about that, you know what I mean? But shout out to him to even, you know, to think that, you know what I mean? He played overseas for a long time. You know, now he's giving back, you know what I mean? But I'm pretty sure during the summer we'll talk about it because now, you know, the goal is – for him to, you know, position himself to yeah. be a to be a head coach. Do, you know do, I mean? do y'all see do y'all see college in the um future? If it makes sense. Okay. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, I think my whole goal is 
college, but it's only college to help New York City. Yeah, definitely. definitely. You know what I mean? Like, I don't think that my goal is just I want to be in college just because. You know what I mean? Like, right now, I'm, I'm riding my own ship. You know what I mean? Like, so it has to make sense. You know, I'm building my legacy. You know, who knows? You know, but if, if the right college, if it makes sense, if it makes sense for New York, you know what I mean? Like, the whole New York, then cool. You know what I mean? I'm a team player. Mm. You see, we got New Heights facility. We both on the coaching staff for the 15s. What's that like? Being there, being with all our talent, different kids, new kids, we all dealing with both me and you. But from your, your perspective, what it's like to be dealing with that and we trying to get them to learn the game and, and teach them the game, how, how it's really need to be taught and show them the discipline and even off the court with things like that. Like, how do you feel about that? I mean, it's dope, you know what I mean? Like, I, I, ain't, I never wanted to be an AAU coach. You know what I mean? Like, that wasn't something that was, you know, in the back of my mind. Everything is about timing, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? Like, everything in life is about timing. I could have had opportunities years ago to coach, new, you know, to come to New Heights. Mm -hmm. And I think this group, this coaching staff, you know, how the organization is, it kind of was like, you know what, it's home. You know, we probably not going to have every kid from Brooklyn, but it's a Brooklyn feeling, you know what I mean? Like, so it's dope. We super talented. You know, this is the, this is the future, you know, of our basketball in New York. Um, and you deal with a lot of personalities. You know, realistically, it's a whole lot different from high school. You know, you get the same kids, but it's all one age group. So sometimes in high school you get the mature ones, then you get the young ones that are freshmen and sophomore. But this mix is a little bit different. And you want to see the feedback. You know what I mean? You want to see, you know, how the kids are when you started to now and the feedback that the parents is given. You see the comments that they're making about the kids, you know, how he's playing now, how this person is playing now, keep it up, you know. So that's always something to look forward to. And it's just like, you know what? What, what we saying, you know, besides the organization, me, Ra, and Coach Green, who's coaching them, that they actually starting to, you know, realize that, you know, we know, we know what we're talking about. We've been there on all levels, you know what I mean, and different angles, you know, of life, because that's all it's about really is, you know, the life lessons first. I've been watching, well, I've been watching Mel Mel, some other kids through middle school and all that, but the watch, Y'all do these sessions on this EYBL pretty much the hardest circuit to play on. You know, we, we ain't going to like, mm -hmm. put it like it's the, probably the hardest circuit to play on. Sucks. A Nike, the Nike circuit. So, like, walking into that, like, I've been watching y'all since the first session. I got the Twitch app. I'm always on Synergy. I watch, like, physically. Can we, can we get something done with CP3? Because they starting to become a real serious problem for me. I know, I know they're real talented, the point guard real good. I, we got a lot of respect for them, but they starting to become a real problem for me. They like a buzz, they like a buzz in the air. That's crazy. Who asked me? I think one of my, my teammates, it was like, you think, no, not one of my teammates, my, one of my players. It's like, Coach G, you think they got your number? And I was like, nah. And the first thing I did Monday morning was go online and watch the game. And we just got to finish. It ain't too much more of what they doing. It's more of what we're not doing. You know what I mean? It's one thing if they got your number. It's 10-point game, 12-point game. It's coming down to the wire. You know what I mean? Um, I think this game would have been a little different if Mel Mel, you know, played the last six, seven, seven minutes. minutes yeah. You know what I mean? I think that that was a big difference because he's our engine. You know, he's one of the best point guards in the country. He can pass real well. You know what I mean? He knocked down shots. So... I think that at full power, we are, right, but we'll see them. Those two three point games, if we do see them, it's going to be a different ball game. They will be ready. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not used to losing to no country cats like that. I definitely had to add that in because, you know. Like, By the way, yeah, right. we, we played against CP3 and AAU. I ain't lose, so I don't even like losing to him, even though that's my bro. You, you know, sometimes, <laughs> if you know, sometimes that'd be the. That'd be the problem right the director remember those days when y'all was kicking them around 
Now that they see you on staff, they trying to spit back. <laughs> now, I mean, I, I know those are the conversations. They trying to spit back. Like, just look through that whole circuit, right? A lot of y'all play high-level basketball. When you look on each, I seen Paul George, all these guys pull up. They got teams, they coaching, they doing assistant, Ray Allen, all these dudes. It was times where they was cracking it, beating everybody. So mm -hmm. now when opposing coaches and parents see we just our time to get our lick back because now he's sitting on a bench. He can't really perform. Like you don't get those conversations. Like y'all remember y'all was beating us like that, but now it's different now. But you don't think that C three three game was like you know, the staff like yo nah I remember them. I remember G R. I was t I, I I hit up uh, C P brother when I see them on the schedule and I was talking to him and I told him that we was gonna get at them. <laughs> and he started laughing like, gee, look at you. The same as back in the day. But you know what I mean? Like, it was always dope. I know one person, Steph Hanna from Chicago. I don't know if y'all remember we had those battles at, at, at Gersh, Chicago versus New York. Yeah, definitely. And, like, he a gritty one. So when we played against uh, Mac Irvin, mm. son with the dress. Yeah. You know what I mean? We was talking about it. But, you know, it's dope to actually be around it. You know what I mean? To see how, you know, things change from when we actually played in the Nike circuit, you know, really wasn't called the EYBL. Yeah, just, but everything is kind of the same. You go from, you know, state to state, and the last one is in Augusta. But it's dope to actually be one of those players that, you know, I played it, now I'm coaching it. So I, I like that. Oh, it's nice. Yeah, like, I mean, like, you, let me trans back to this NAS thing, man. Like, it's really sent with me. I want to also give a big shout out to Billy, right? How how was that Fact. the kid that Billy was coming coming back to Holy Cross? Cause now y'all be in Brooklyn, Queens, right? Yeah. Same. So what you think? What you think those battles would be? You think it helps the help the the conference, the division? Cause um, frankly, um, all the um, uptown teams keep winning the Catholic League, so something's had to change. Uh, definitely it do. It changed a lot. <clears throat> you know what I mean? Like. You know, his winning pedigree, you know, he's a he's a dope coach, you know. So I think, it, you know, it just gives the Kaplan School a different look. You know, no one really knows what to expect. I don't know if, you know, they think they put Naz in to be a punching bag, but uh, I don't know. I don't, I don't really, I don't really, you know what I mean? I, was about to say, I, um, I, I honestly feel now you would target. Been a target like, all my life, all your life, but I get it. But I'm saying, as far as the kids now too, they gotta understand that scheduling is a little different. The scheduling is nah, different, but a little different. now it's people that want to play y'all. Yeah. People that probably was hesitant before, they're gonna want to play just cause we know how it go at certain times. We know how it go. People that now is gonna be throw them on the schedule ASAP. Let's 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 get them ASAP. Now it's it's to that now. How do you get the kids? How do the kids stay motivated? How is, how is, how is the get them all on that page to know that yo we not in this league no more? Like, they, the grind got to be extra harder, or the grind got to be this. So I mean, I put that in their ear right away, <clears throat> like the mm. next day. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, well, we, celebration ain't you know ain't really too much. You know what I mean? We haven't done nothing. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, we moved up, but. We gotta, we gotta do something, you know. Y'all ask for this, you know. Y'all, y'all build for this, so, you know what I mean? It's, it's y'all, it's, it's, it's y'all story, you know. How y'all gonna write it? You know, my story written, you know what I mean? So, the biggest thing about that is that you gotta get up every single day, you know. What I mean, you can't be like, ah, we gonna play against a team that we might be better than, or we bigger than, or you know, we more talented than. Now, every day, you step on that court. You know what I mean? It's, it's time to work. I mean, the biggest thing is they got a coach that love to be in the gym. So we going to grind. You know what I mean? Like, so I'm going to prepare them as best as, you know, as possible. But, um, yeah, we do get some, you know, some different calls. You know what I mean? That's for sure. You know what yeah. I mean? You get some different calls because nobody wants to be like, all right, we playing against an A school, but if they beat us, then what? Okay. I do respect, the, you know, a, a few that were willing to play us, you know, like, two years ago, you know what I mean? So now we'll definitely be one of those teams to where we was in that position, 
So if we got to play a team that's in the A that's good, yeah. I'm going to play them. You know what I mean? Like, I ain't, I'm not going to say that I'm going to play everybody, but mm-hmm. I'm definitely going to do it because, you know, I had some coaches that, you know, did it for me to make sure that, yo, no matter what, I'm going to help you get to where, you know, y'all, 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 you know, should be. So I think, you know, it's only right that you return the favor. I mean, y'all know, we got G. Irv, man, like, like, this is like probably one of our biggest celebs, right? Is your celeb status? He Brooklyn baby boy. Been there for years. From high school to now, definitely celeb status. Definitely celeb status, man. I'm for the people, baby. <laughs> for the people. You Question. know what I mean? Like, can the Splash Bros talk get a game? It's starting to get annoying again that I got to tussle. I should be able to get a game this year. All right, Bishop Lachlan. Mm. That's an old rivalry. On the spot. Right. That's, that, 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 that used to be a rivalry. On the spot. You know what I mean? like, get, that's, get the date, forward the date. That's done. Let me make sure it's on a Friday. Done. Friday. We we owe you that. We've been trying we were trying to get there about one to two years. And, and I think it's needed for my brand and you know everybody that support basketball to come support y'all because like you y'all the future. Like I'm I'll be honest with you. I was ecstatic when y'all went up. Fuck. When they put it in the chat, I woke up, I was like, it said Naz double A. I'm like, nah, I ain't know what he was talking about. I said, Oh, Nazareth? <laughs> So I, I, I'm, I'm a static, like, mm-hmm. oh, nah, it's that's lit. lit. It's lit. Because, like, I watched the grind. I watched, I watched, I've been playoff games. I went to the chip game at Fordham. Like, I, wa- I watched how you battle with those kids. I was like, they can hang in a double A. I don't see why you can't hang in a double A. You got it. Any date, or I could finish the schedule, and you can look at it, but I think that that's dope. You know what I mean? It's in Brooklyn, Brooklyn versus Brooklyn. You know what I mean? You get the like, Brooklyn, Brooklyn, the real, you get to bring back some of these Brooklyn vibes. real rivalries, the real vibes back. You can start now that you in the double now. A. Cause you know, so like you said, you in, the, you in the A, some coaches like, yeah, y- y- y'all winning, but like, is it really worth it? We go play y'all, we lose, and now it's like teams, they got like, oh, we got we got no choice to see y'all. But shout out to Bishop Lachlan, because last year they actually did that. Okay. You know what I mean? They ain't say, all right, we'll play y'all in the scrimmage. We play them in an actual game. You know what I mean? So that was, you know, that was it right there. That was the start of something. That was you know the start of something, right? Yeah. Okay. So that was the start of something because, you know, they it's like, you know what? Yeah, we're going to play y'all. I mean, I had to really pressure for a few years, but you know what I mean? Like, it finally happened, you know. So definitely shout out to, you know, Gonzalez and them. And actually shout out to a few of the coaches in AA that hit me, you know, saying that they seen what we've been doing and, you know, and actually hitting me to say congratulations. You know what I mean? You don't get that from a lot of people. You could tell when it's fake and real, you know, it just felt genuine. You know what I mean? So appreciate them for that as well. Top five, your top five ball players in high school right now that's not in your school. New York City. All right, all right. Boogie Flan. Like them for, you know, some time. It's tough because, you know, you start missing out on names. Uh, it's just your fault. Connor. Uh, Got to thank him. Still, because they still not like seniors this yeah, year. Yeah, still. still. That's got like yeah, definitely got one more year. <laughs> that got yeah, one more yeah. year. So Boogie, Connor, uh, B stores, mm. B stores. I like, I like, I like B stores. I like B stores. Um, I think Man Man is me. Wow. I think he me. Why you say that? Just a little short. He's a dog. He played both sides. He's 94 feet. He don't never get tired. That's me. You know what That's I mean? True. That's me. Like, I see, I've been saying that since I seen him walk in high school, that he's me. So, uh, him. Hmm. That's four. Damn. I don't 
might be stuck in New York. Uh, can't even think of no schools like that. Maybe, I like Chopper. I think I like Chopper. I like Chopper. I think he deserved more credit. You know what I mean? Like, I think he gets some he credit. Get, he get the, um, the Batman Robin get, treatment. It's Batman and Batman. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Definitely like, agree with it's that. Batman and Batman. Dude is an assassin. You know what I mean? He played with attitude. He still played the right way into where, you know what I mean? Like, he could shoot from when he walk in the gym. Yeah, definitely. You know what I mean? Like, so I like, I like him. I could be missing, you know, a few. You know, when you start thinking of stuff off the spot, you yeah. miss out on, you know, a lot. Just but, trying to catch you ooh. on the spot. Yeah, you can name still name people if you want to. The most underrated guard in New York is uh is is is, is Taj Bryant. Facts. I could agree with that's, you. That's that's my that's I I love I could him. agree with you. I just Brooklyn seen Brooklyn him this Eagles. weekend. Yeah, I Shout love him. I love I love I love him. Like across the board, bro. He's 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 that deal. And he, and he also went down to Dallas and, and put in work up. and got busy. And turned up. And turned up. And got busy. He's He's like that. I like him. Just spinning right back. Oh, he's back. Yeah, he's oh, back. Oh, he's back too. with the game. Yeah, he's back. He's back. Well, well since we since we did, was well, well, name drop. Give me give me two or three names. I know Connor should be back. Oh, we ain't gonna talk about the people that's back. Okay. You know, so you want to know who's back? Haylon, Connor, and and Ties, but. Uh, we got a few. We got a few. We got. We got a few hitters, bro. I know some. We of them, got a I few hitters. Them, I know some of them rosters been had to been starting to be submitted in. Oh, it did. It did. It did. You know what I mean? Like certain. Like I said, it's one of those to where you be like, all right, okay. Well, yeah, he on our roster or he on a roster, but he might be playing with somebody else. But we got. We got a good roster. I mean, I think across the board we're solid. Nah, solid is maybe an understatement. I, I, I know it's one kid supposed to be making their way to Brooklyn, and, and this is my thing, right? <laughs> Say his name. The, the the young kid that's at glasses school. Like, how like how is he going past those two boroughs to go to play in Brooklyn? Like, Ooh. big kid. The wings. Oh, yeah, the wings. Yes. How he want to win? I, I, excuse me. He want to win. I just can't sit, don't sit well with me. It just don't sit well. Like he's, I get it. He's leaving. He got a Bronx. He got to go past Manhattan. Posh had to do that. Sean Fulcher had to do that. And Zaire it, Wells had to do that. Yeah, it, 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 and it Dante had to do that. Yeah, it didn't work out. had to do that. Yeah. Chris had to do that. You know what I mean? Like, so, J both Jakai. The Avion. You know what I mean? Like, so, I don't, it's we true. say that it's just not enough. You know what I mean? Like, that says a lot about both. I don't know how many of any other boroughs you see on Gersh team, though. It's rare. One player. It's at the max. We had Adam last year. That was it. That was it. Everything else, everything else was broken. Years before that. Brooklyn, like as long as I was coaching. Is that, is that a part? And shout out to Gersh. He, he allowed y'all to just do. He don't really step into the meetings. He allowed y'all to do put the rosters together. Just shout out to the whole Gersh staff and like you know DP, we all DP. Go, DP we always. Compete. That's my big bro right yeah, there. New York versus Dave New York. Dave Shout out my I God, always DP. Ask him, like he like, I don't have nothing to do with rosters. I don't have nothing to do with. Nothing. We just submit it all in, and he just watch. You got to trust. You know what I mean? Like, that's the biggest thing. You know, he trusts, you know, our, our, you know, our connections, you know, how we coach. You know what I mean? Which is, which is dope. But I think that the reason why we kind of try to stay Brooklyn, besides that, you know, Brooklyn always feel that like Brooklyn basketball is the best. You know what I mean? But it's like, why give somebody else the opportunity that you can give somebody in your backyard? True. You know what I mean? Like, we probably the only teams that we don't go with names. You know what I mean? Like, if you look at it, it's rare that we have those kids that be top 50, top 75. You know, top 75, yeah. You know, Ty Law. Ty you know Law what I mean? probably the highest ranked one you had. Period, though. 
I'm yeah. talking about even when Kadari yeah, and all of them was there. You got to think about it. We got two twins that nobody wanted, right? That wasn't even a talk in New York. Champagne the Champagne brothers. brothers. They both in the league, but it wasn't being talked about when they was in New York like that. And he wound up being our leading scorer and, you know, got True. a chip. So, like, I think that that's what we do a good job of. We take the underdogs and we build our team, you know what I mean, how, how it's supposed to happen. So, I mean, I think that that's what we continue to do is not get those, you know, those high names or whatever it is. Let's just hoop. Top five street ball. Take, take your name out and not, not with you in it. Yeah, take your name out. Got to take your name out. I'm out of all that. Damn, y'all just I mean, wilding well, right well, now. I mean, yeah. I'm going to be honest with you. You averaged 26 points last year at Gersh. So I don't know Ooh. why would you not think. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? But we're going to exclude your name. 26 points is tough. Take your time, too. Yeah. Top five. Yeah, because that's that might be the first part of the um the wild. clip that's gonna drop. Fact. This is this is this. this is wild. Um, by the way, I don't give a damn how they feel. <laughs> 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 State business. Uh I love JC. One. You know what I mean? Like it ain't no real order. Ain't no order, just no, no order. I Definitely. I love no order. I love I love J C. Um You ain't see a lot of them last year, but he probably one of the best, if not the best, guard in New York. Bryce Jones. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Shout out to Bryce. That's yeah. a bad young that's, that's, fella. That's a bad, Shout out to Bryce. That's a bad light skinned guard, Boy. too. <laughs> he is it. And I, you know what I mean? The funny thing is, like, you know, everything is about vision. When he first came home and he was, like, struggling, I was working for him, trying to get him to, 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 to Australia. And he hit me like your big bro. I got a, you know, I got a deal, but I appreciate you for that. But like, when you see the progress, yeah, he big dog. Now man. he's one of the best, not only in the town but in Europe. Fact. You know what I mean? Like, so shout out to him. So that's uh, that's two. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's go to a big man. I'm gonna go lucky lefty. Mm. See if y'all can guess that one. I know that. Lefty. Is. Lefty. See who? See who? See yeah. who? Anybody know that? Yeah, 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 yeah. See who? See who? And it's crazy how you think it's easy to stop that left, I, but that's a different but, animal. And we done said this on numerous part. Like, he's probably one of the best bigs that really don't play about that rep. Facts. Zach Randolph. Yeah. Fact. He's Zach Randolph. He's, he's going to get that double double. He's going to get the double double. He's going to get it. That's three. Mm. John Parks. Yeah. Damn. That's a good one. That was I like that one. John 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 Parks. I like I, lo I love Shout that. out to JP, man. John Parks. I think that Definitely. that's a uh that's another one you watched his growth. Everybody was just yeah. calling him Chris from the Wire. They changed that Chris from the Wire to his regular name yeah. because he do more than jump. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? He do more to jump. He a bucket. However you want, one leg. You know, fadeaways, three ball. Definitely. You know what Definitely. I mean? He hoop. And um, you know, at sometimes in life you gotta be biased. You know what I mean? Sometimes, just sometimes. He might not play a lot in New York, but they gonna see a lot of him this summer. Dane Miller. Tough. They gonna see him. Mm. They gonna see him. Oh yeah, no, nah, he been he Dan been is, he been killing Dan in the town, different. but now like he's spreading his wings. You know what I mean? Like you know he's starting to get you know that love and that recognition. You know what I mean? Like he's you know what I mean just as good as a lot of them. So we gonna see. You know what I mean? But that, that five is kind of different. A super 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 good summer. I got one more. You know what I mean? No, nah, that's five. That was I know. Five. I got one more. Oh, you got one more. Yeah, because, I mean, I be needing help. You, know you I mean? and four others you would want to play with, Street Bull. Four others I would want to play with? 
your top that you would want to play with your bigs like those the, the five you just name is your five that you're all right and, it, and it's the people that is it has to be people that i didn't play with though fact didn't you that didn't I never, play, you I never, never played play with ah oh, damn because i wanted to put mac in there because i love him i brought mac outside to hoops in the sun he got mvp so <laughs> Average like forty. <laughs> yeah, I definitely, I definitely used to when go. When nobody was talking about him, so I'm gonna put him to the side. You know what I mean? Because I, um, Jordan Parks. Uh, you are the one. Who would you put out your two? At my two. Or you have who would be the other guard if you wanted to be the two? You know how you get at times. I said what? You and Z. Yeah. You never played the game? Big guard, nah. Sheesh. Oh, my bad. I mean, that that really don't count. <laughs> I brought him out to Gersh when he was in high school. Nah, like, but that 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 you didn't play with him. Yeah, you know I mean, like so. Um, I say Whitehead. You Whitehead. Now who your three? Um. Uh. Uh. JP. Oh, of course. I ain't know if I want to put him at the. You know, cause. You oh, know, I got it. My fault. This this put him at this this year. He a stress four five. This yours. This your list. So. Um, you you got you and Zeke in the backcourt. Me and Zeke, I got see who, see who. Mm. I got Jordan. Damn. And I gotta think about this one. Let me let me think, cause you know I can be missing out on some ball players. Um, it's starting four. It's crazy. That, 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 that four. I think the four. That four probably can win two, three champions. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Y'all yeah, messing my brain up, bro. I can't even get my, that, my fit because that four right there could win you two, three. <laughs> Y'all definitely could clean a hundo on the on the on the back. It'll be cleaning yeah. up with that four. I'm missing somebody, but I'm a. I can't really think, but I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go bird. A healthy bird. Mm. A healthy Ryan Pearson. Mm. I'm gonna go healthy bird because that's a lot of mismatch problems. Like all of them could post, all of them could pass, all of them could shoot, and they could switch, go like, everything. You, can, you know what I mean? Like I, I think that I would that would be my five. I think that. So, me and Whitehead with um, Bird. Um, Jordan Parks and and C Hoops, I think that that's that's yeah, yeah that y'all definitely could clear. If y'all watching, yeah, yeah, that definitely could clear three or four tournaments. I think that you know, what I, mean? I I would enjoy it. You know what I mean, that'd be that'd be dope. We gonna we gonna name some people or or things one word to describe the person we name. I bet. Bad or the or the or the team or Arkansas Razorbacks. One word to describe them. Relentless. Mississippi State. Mm. Lesson. Robeson. Major. Ross. <laughs> it's got to be two, though. I know. Go ahead. I was going to go Ross and then. So Don, I was gonna go, yes. Don King. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I had to add Ross to there. Mike, don't forget, the, like, they support you. I support you so much. Like, Ross is like. Brooklyn, 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 Brooklyn. So I definitely, if I ain't throw Ross in there, I definitely would have probably got, you, you forgot me, you forgot me, but not one, like really one word or two words to describe Ross, Mike, all these dudes, those, like those is like, I call them unks. Uncle Mike, <clears throat> he probably my biggest supporter, bro. You know what I mean? Real talk. You know what I mean? Like, if everybody didn't know me, they'd think he my pops. Yo. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> Yeah, I used to be like, yo, I ain't, after a while, I just start calling him Unk. That's a fact. Like, for a while, I just say Unk. Every time I see Jerry, yo, yo, what's up with Unk? He either going to say Ross or Mike. Which one? He'd be like, nah, he over here. 
Like when you get that kind of support to come watch you the the coach. Like I I got friends and some family that come watch me announce. Mm -hmm. But you talking about dudes that you're not even playing basketball. You just right. still come and support you. That's that's supporting you in life. That's different. That's different. You know what I mean? But you know what I mean? You always have those people. You know what I mean? Like well, at least I did. You know what I mean? Whether it was good, bad, or indifferent, they always held it down. You know what I mean? I don't think they're gonna stop. Like Uncle Ross is retarded. Like he called me, <laughs> he called me, and just be like, "Yo, who call you, who called me more? Me, or Uncle Mike. I'm trying to call you more." Like, <laughs> yo, 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 that sound like Ross though, because Ross yo, got my number. He a Facetime, he a Facetime me through the Instagram. Yes. Like he and he and Rose, he man. loved the people too. The you man. know what I mean? Like he showed love to everybody. You know what I mean? Like so, but mm. man, we, yo, ass. we got Jerv, man. Like we could have you here for hours. Like you probably probably our, our, our biggest guest we had so far, not excluding. Oh, we had to step. We had step here. We I had step. We had step, we had was, step here. That was fire. We had step like, here, and that was after the chip. Yeah. Right, uh, before, right before the chip. Right before, before the chip. So Playoff run. Yeah. Not the state. That yeah, that's what I'm saying. After yeah, they at won, the state. Yeah, yeah. Yep. The city. The city, city. Yeah. I mean, but that's still, you know, that's dope. You know what I mean? To get the whole team, coach, that's fire. What y'all doing is different too, though. You know what I mean? Like, I mean, so. we 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 want to stay away left from politics because we could go the politic route and, and you know do it for clickbait. But we just want we want to build it, you know, with, with Ike and and all the people. Uh, we got a lot of people that support and, and push this. The scenes. I mean, we want to do it different. Like we want to go, just be, just be us. Like we don't want to, we don't really want to do nothing for the clickbait. And we could talk about job. We could talk about NBA. We could talk about players getting traded. This coach got fired for just for some clicks. So we want to earn our clicks, and we want to bring the right people that support the town, support New York City, support what we trying to do, and. Do I mean, it in the right way. And do it in the right way. Like, you know, we could clickbait. We could clickbait all these episodes and, like, yo, but mm -hmm. like, we don't want to talk down on somebody who's struggling or, or just, you know, dealing with life. You have to bring to, you on. I mean, try to big you up. Know what I mean, mean you big you know, up. won't bring I mean. you down to big us up. So that's, I think that's the direction we trying to go in. And we, it was needed to bring GR. We was able to get you because you, you busy. So, nah, I appreciate that. You. Appreciate that. And <clears throat> I want to really say, you know, shout out to, you know, Nas. You know what I mean? For real. Like, um, it's rare that you get, you know, people that believe in you right away. You know what I mean? Your vision and what you see. I mean, got a dope principal over there. Administration is dope. You know what I mean? My assistant principal been talking to me about coming here for the last five years. You know what I mean? Like, so shout out to, like, Mr. DeRay, Miss Roberts, you know, Sandy, you know, um, you know, Augie, Coach Mike. You know what I mean? People don't know Coach Mike. They probably just see him, but dude is dope. You know what I mean? Like, he real dope with kids. He's been through it. He's been around the Catholic School League. You know, he got, you know, a lot of connections in the Catholic School League. You know what I mean? Like, I could have went and tried to, you know, do my own thing get you know the people that i'm close to but you know what i mean like coach mike deserved just as much credit you know what i mean as me so you know shout out to all of them and really shout out to the parents too let's not forget because they they believed in that too you know when their kids could have went anywhere else you know to try to you know play double did any of the parents reach out before we close out but did any of these parents do because a lot of parents sometimes don't really know how the conference jumping, how that, did any of the parents reach out about the, like moving up to the double A? Like some of the parents that's currently on your team. Um, you know. That's coming back and stuff like that. They really just know what everybody else tell them or what they hear or, you know, listen to, like I say, we quote unquote got to say the hype because we were A yeah. and double A, but all of them, you know, know who I am, you know, they see like, you know, like I'm a big brother mentor, you know, father figure to the kids. So they understood from that part, but you know, they also decided that, all right, I hear what y'all saying. Y'all want my kid to go double A, but you know, I trust the process here. You know what I mean? So it's just dope that the people that started, 
you know, is the people that, you know, benefits that. And just before I leave, I wish that my seniors this year was able to to get it to get that, to get it, the experience you know, for the double A this double A stuff because it really started with them. They was the first group of you know people that played and you know deserve it. So shout out to you know my seniors Andre Jules, um, Lakai, you know you know Big Jeremiah and my little cousin Tramel. You know and the people before it. Okay. Um, Rod, you want to sign us out? It's a Brooklyn edition. Oh, no. We just want to definitely thank you. We definitely want to thank you. This shit was given. We just started and never ended. Place us in a dollar. Give a fuck about a visit.